hello everyone assalamu alaikum welcome to my channel in this video i will show you how to connect your node.js application with mongodb database locally so before we start we need one module to be installed after this you have to install express mongodb for creating your database and um, this uh mongoose for uh connecting to the mongodb so easily because uh, mongoose is uh ROM relational object uh, mapping database that will allow you to connect with database so easily so before you need to install these modules so you have to install express mongodb and mongoose so uh, you just need to open your terminal and npm install mongodb and remaining you can install it then here so uh we need to uh first we need to get the local url so let me yeah go go to your compass after you install uh, mongodb you you install this uh, Mongoose, uh mongodb compass then copy this and come to your app here and install it okay sorry and then copy copy then paste it here yeah. oh sorry why are you getting this thing you need to copy this yeah then put a uh, forward slash then let's put let's call our database person this is the name that you want to call your database like this so let's save it then we need to connect this database using mongoose so just come here and use this mongoose dot connect here has this mo method connect that take two parameters one is the url of your database then the other one is update for the security purpose so for now let's leave it like this after you we run this it will show you the things that you're supposed to put here because of security for the uh mongodb so uh because this is a single we need to then because we need to know that if everything connect normal then it will console console dot log something that we know that our database connects so several so database connected for example then we need to dot catch to catch if any error occur uh yeah no. error we need to catch any error that oko while connecting we need to print it to see it like this so uh this is a sync we connect it here so before this we need to uh initialize our express app equals to express like so so let's come here and okay let me initialize our port our port here as 3000 so our app will go into listing at this for 3000 so let's come here and app dot listing let's put our port because this can take one parameter or two you uh, yeah, is two but the other one is option we just want to know whether our app is uh whether the server is running or not then let's console console it console.log server is running at then we need to concatenate this port 
just for to know the databases so let's create one route so that we can access it on browser to see uh, let's go get get uh, this will take the two parameters one is the path we want to direct to and the other one is function that take two parameter request and respond like so so this uh, let's let's just send let's send something to the browser let's put h1 just to say hello from not js app like so so like this so as you see now uh, in our compass we didn't connect with anything so uh, when we uh, oh getting very slow like this so we need to connect with our database using this so we need to go and this uh, we need to connect this with the database that we here yeah, we want to create at this place so what this thing I said now test it here oh something getting So let's then connect. I don't know why my system is so slow today. Yeah, it's initializing the connection. So let's see. Let's wait and see. Uh, while waiting, let's uh, try around our code our app okay let's say app we call it app not this then uh let me run this app to see you see it's trying to run our application it's trying to run and this is trying to connect also so if it shows something like uh, if something were wrong, it will show us here. That's why we uh, console this to see if it is connected. It will say that I was connected. So if not, we will see this error. Yeah, you see server is running at this uh, port that we initialized 3000 and database connected. So you see, our database now is connected. As you can see now, you see fasten. As uh, you see this local, local, and you see this. So if you want to, okay, this local is uh, the other one that I use. So if you want to, if you want to know, uh, you want to see the real uh, first, you need to create this uh, schema but this is the easy way to connect with your database mongodb but you need to create schema if you want to start uh, sending data from your node.js application to this thing but we can go and connect uh, see our app here let me show you our app is running at this spot yeah you can if you need something you can go to mongoose as you see now but let me go to local host column showing error host column then uh, host like this then 3000 slash let's leg on yeah you 
you see our app is connected so uh, that is it how to connect your node.js application with mongodb database i hope this will help you and if you find it so helpful please uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, if there is anything that uh, you didn't understand just post it in the comments so that i can make another video or i will clear the air for you so thanks for watching i will see you in the next video thank you